Welcome back to the reentry buzz. We just finished recording an episode and we were drinking the Star Word collab with Lagavulin and it was delicious. But now that show is over and now it's Cole over. and I battle it out where we blind sample something that was randomly chosen from our collection. We have no idea what it is. And no actually, idea. I poured it and I set the Glen down next to this other Glen. Uh, and I'm pretty sure I have the right one in my hand now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually like 95% sure that I was good. One. But anyway, Cole and I have no idea what this is. We are going no to nose it, sip it, give notes, give guesses where we think it comes from and what the proof is and everything. And then we're going to see who's closest to the right answer. What do you think, Cole? Let's do it. Uh, let's, yeah, sniff and sip. Give it one little taste, and then we'll mm. rate it. Or we'll say how much we'll pay for it. We'll just, you know how it goes, peeps. It, it is a beautiful golden color here. <laughs> Literally sniffed it through my nose. Into my nose. <laughs> so That's going to be memorable. Pause Literally and come like back in two hours. Literally into my nose. <laughs> Can like, you give us some my, nose my notes? My nostril is burning right now. This is worse than Dickel in my eye. Give it. Give us some nose notes, man. These should be the best nose man, notes ever. My, my, yeah, it should be. You're just setting me up. <laughs> <this stuff here. laughs> I got to like breathe this one off. Goodness. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely in my nose right now. Um, all right. Um, how much would I pay for this after I sip it? How much would you pay to inject this into your nostril? Mm-hmm. I'm going to let you go first on the pay. I'd pay 100 for this. Funny. Really? Funny, Cole. Funny. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I like it. Uh-huh. But I think I'm sitting around 80. Okay. Yeah. I think I know what this is. It's there's a there's an extreme familiarity here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So we'll be right back and we will take our notes. We'll take our guesses. And you'll hear those guesses and notes right after this quick break. <laughs> I I you know, me and Brian are both decently confident not overconfident not too confident uh, but we both feel pretty good about this one and i have a feeling where it's going to be really close and high scoring at the same time (laughs) um it's all going to come down to probably the proof um in my you know presence of this all um let's talk about it i'm going to go through my notes real quick and then i'll let brian go through his notes uh here are my notes uh bourbony Appley sweet on the nose. Um, some of my favorite notes of all time. You see where we're going with this, people? Uh, palette. I said this palette screams Buffalo Trace and higher proof Buffalo Trace. It reminds me of Stag. And that's what I said for the palette. <laughs> Straight up finish. guessing in the palette notes. Yeah, I yeah like pretty it. much. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and the finish, I said really nice Buffalo Tracy finish. Cherries and apples. Delicious. Uh, so I'm nice. digging it. What, what did you get on the notes? Yeah, notes, uh, nose notes, medicinal cherry, tobacco, and I wrote awesome funky. Nice. Uh, palette, I said, that was a nickname in college. Awesome funky. Hey, here comes awesome funky. <laughs> hey! Hey. <laughs> palette, I said, rye spice and cherry and intense. Nice. And finish, I said, long spice and earthy oh, funk. Beautiful. All right. I'll go through my guesses, then you can go through yours. Cool. Type, bourbon, secondary grain, rye, (laughs) distillery, buffalo trace. Uh, Proof, I went with 124 here. We'll see. Uh, Age, I said nine. Uh, Finished, nope. Uh, Bottle, stag. That's what I said. Score, 9.1. Love this. Love it. Wow. It's amazing. So I'm just going to blow through mine because they're very similar to yours. <laughs> Tight bourbon, secondary yep. grain rye, distillery buffalo trace. Uh, and let me skip uh, con- okay, to consolidate here. Still yeah. uh, also agree bottle stag junior. 
um finish no um uh score was nine but where we differed here was i said Age proof improved. i said proof 131 i wanted Ooh. to stick i wanted to stick close to 130 because i uh um, better bet yeah, anyway, uh, stags are usually around there. So I wanted did you to say age eight or nine age. I did say eight, actually. Yeah. OK, Ooh. so uh, so but we were very close. If on we're age. right. There's no age statement. Yeah, so. I know. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Are we cool. doing this? Wow, it's going to be really close. Uh, know, yeah, right? let's do it. Here we go. So, yeah, all down to proof, actually. Yeah, like you said. Oh, oh. it is very close. Same okay. Nashville. Wow. Same everything except what? what's different? Between so the, probably age. You're right that it's the same Mashville. And actually, this there was an interesting discussion about this in a Discord server that I'm in recently, uh -huh. where what's the difference? Oh, I'm yeah. sorry, listeners and viewers. This is E.H. Taylor Barrel Proof Batch yeah. 12. Yeah. So what's the difference between this and Stag? And, and you know, there's no definitive answer here as far mm -hmm. as I know. But it's got to just be a, a desire for... Uh, tasting notes, a desire yeah. for uh, maintaining a, a certain brand character that they want to see mm -hmm. versus in Stag versus what they want to see in H. Taylor. And it, if it aligns with what one decision of the brand is, they'll just slap an E.H. Taylor label on it for that one or slap a Stag label on it for the other one. So um, that's my opinion. What mm -hmm. do you think, Cole? I knew nothing. I actually never even considered that. That like I knew they were the same mash bill, and I knew they were both barrel proof, uh, and I knew they were always you know each batch was slightly different. But I th I find that cool. So it's really all going to come. And I think you won if it comes down to just the proof because you said one thirty one. Did you Google the proof? Well, it says one twenty nine on this. Oh, I didn't even write it on. Oh, Sam wrote these labels. Yeah. Oh, There's nice. A 129 that's why it's so classy in the, looking. In the tiny corner up there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's cool. Uh, I didn't even remember. I legitimately did not remember that we had an EH Day barrel proof in that's the bucket. Right. I didn't either. Yeah. yeah. Didn't even cross my mind. <laughs> so, okay. We'll be right back. We'll score it all. But I have a feeling Brian won this one by only like two points probably. But we'll be right back. We'll score it all. We'll see who won. All right, we're back. And first off, we have to make a slight clarification here. Yep. Uh, my bad uh, when these labels were being made. Um, this is actually batch 11. I don't own a batch 12. I owned a batch 11, and I used the last little bit of it to pour these samples for us. Uh, and to uh, ensure that we're correct about that, this truly has the proof of 129 yep. written on it, which is what zero batch mm -hmm. 11 was. Yep. So let me tell you how we did here, because this is pretty insane. This is one of the highest scoring. Uh, it, you, it's almost like we're really familiar with Buffalo Trace products or something. <laughs> I was hoping for something like this anytime soon. I was like, I need a good yeah. Buffalo Trace note. Right, yeah. right. Okay, yeah. so we both said bourbon. We both got three points. Mm -hmm. We both said secondary grain rye. We both get three points. Yep. We both said Buffalo Trace. We both get five points. Oh, five, yeah. Cole said 124 proof. I said 131 oh. proof. It is 129. Cole was off by five. Brian was off by two. If so I had far. said 125, I would have gotten at least one point off. Yeah. Cole was yeah. literally one proof point away from getting any points, whereas yep. mm -hmm. Brian got three. Three so age points. Cole said nine. I said eight, which is actually really interesting. If I stop on that mm -hmm. for a second, uh, I think if this was actually stag, I wonder if our age guesses would have been slightly lower in the sevens. Good point. -ish range. Well, no, they say like stag is between eight and nine typically. Oh, really? What I hear. And the I reason was... I went nine was because this could have been George T. Stag. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> right. So right. I went higher. Mm -hmm. So no points for age because there's no nope. age statement here. But mm -hmm. finished. Nope. We both said no. So two points yep. each. Uh, bottle. We both guessed stag, which was incorrect. It was each mm -hmm. Taylor Barrel Proof Batch Eleven, and the scores. Cole said nine point one. Brian said nine. We both think that this is pretty freaking good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Total scores. 
Cole got 13. Brian got 16. That's like, okay, let me look at this. That's Brian's. Okay, you, you've won a lot. So that's your fifth win <laughs> for the season. Yeah. Um, but if you win one more, you'll automatically win the whole season. Oh, man. Uh, I only have to win one out of the next three. Yeah, seriously. So you're up three to, or five to two. So up by three. That's impressive. Yep. Much, I mean, like, what was it? Last season I beat you, there was a tie. So I beat you five one, to four, and then there was one tie. Yep, yep. We'll see how it and, goes. Uh, and uh, in last season, each of us are high, you know, omitting the Floki ridiculousness. There was uh, an episode where you scored 13, I scored 13. This mm-hmm. season, you your highest was 11, mine was 10, but yep. we've never been here. It's 13, 16, man, this yep. is blowing it out of the water so that was mm-hmm. fun good scores good scores and hey all to thank little trace for the notes that they provide throughout <laughs> consistently all their products yeah exactly <laughs> there's always apple and there's always cherry sometimes oh so it's, i love it's a it. good time yeah. yep all right guys thanks for joining us uh we'll see you guys next time we'll see if brian takes the clear win lead for the season otherwise hopefully i'll do okay uh, but uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for joining us on the reentry. Bugs. <laughs>